Hello, friends and family. Um, today, I'd like to be sharing my story at my time at ABC from the fall of 2021 to the end of spring of 2022. When I moved to Lancaster to become a college baseball player at ABC, I was recruited by the previous coaching staff before they got fired the first week of me moving in. The new coaching staff had made me feel welcomed at first, but there were red flags that I eventually caught on by the time it was too late. One of the red flags was that the red shirts were never given any attention for their development and never actually helped the players who needed the guidance. During the season, I was on the roster but never played or was asked to warm up in the bullpen. Late in the season, the coach called me into his office and said that I had no talent or skill set and that I will never get clout as a baseball player. This demoralized me, but despite all of this happening, I was still able to pick up the sport I love and transfer to a better place for me. Months after leaving the program and moving back home to San Francisco, I learned that the coaches were saying things behind my back to my teammates about my learning disability and how a former teammate and I were weird because of it. This experience has taught me that coaches and administrators should prioritize the well-being and growth of their athletes above all else. It's important to remember that sports have a potential to bring people together and to teach valuable life skills and provide an outlet for physical activity and stress relief. However, this positive potential can only be realized if there's a culture of respect and inclusivity. And on my best recommendation, I urge anyone who is considering playing sports at a college or a university to do their research, talk to current and former athletes of the program, and make an informed decision before committing to a sports program. My experience at ABC has reminded me that coaches and administrators should always strive to create a positive and supportive environment for their athletes. Now it's been a year since my experience at ABC, and despite my issues with the coaching staff, I had great teammates that I established a brotherhood with and helped me out as much as they could. I wish them nothing but the best, and I hope that they learn and understand about the issues I faced and why they shouldn't go to ABC. I have nothing but respect for them, and I wish it never had to be this way. Um, by the way, thank you for taking the time to read my statement. I hope this finds all you guys well. Um, and this is one thing I haven't said in my statement. Um, just thank you again to my teammates from last year. Um, if it weren't for you guys, I probably wouldn't have stayed as long as I did. It was very, very tough for me to do that, but it is what it is. Sincerely, Brandon.